we have a challenge today. It is the time when I am free. It is, there's my neighbor over there. Watch him wave. No, I didn't wave. Uh, guy's real nice, he uh, mowed up my leaves for me today. Okay, so this is a 360 video again. Remember, you can look all the way around. You can click your mouse and look around, 360 video. All right, what we're doing today is something extra challenging. The, so for video, the lighting isn't very good. If you look up, you can see it's cloudy, it's overcast. It's windy, it's kind of cold, probably 35, 40 degrees. It's very unpleasant, but that's kind of the challenge. I'm also going to a new park, taking my stuff to a brand new park that I've never been to. Um, and that's an extra challenge because you have to find the right place, a place with a table and then a place to, uh, with a tree or something like that. It doesn't have to have a table, but it's a heck of a lot easier to do. Anyway, the goal is one contact and, uh, and that's it. One contact, one CW contact. I need to try using USB uh, or sideband on my KX2, Ellicraft KX2 radio, but I haven't had much success with that. I have, it's so much easier to make a contact in CW. Okay, I also want to make an announcement. I just bought a kit, a wind keyer, which is a key, look up wind key. It's a key that you put to your, uh, to your computer. It's basically from your paddle to your device that I bought. It's a kit, you have to solder it together. And then it goes to your computer and then you can use it to transmit or you don't even need a radio. And that's really why I bought it. I bought it because uh, I wanted to practice without a radio. Uh, I wanted to practice with I'm, I'm having to look around. I've got people all over me, so I'm having to, I'm a little distracted. But I wanted to practice without a radio and there's software programs that you can use this with and you can key and it kind of gives you like a fake QSO. So you can practice there on your computer without being next to a radio, without transmitting. Um, there's some games you can play, like I, I might even develop my own game. Anyway, upcoming announcement, I'm gonna be making videos on this keyer. I'm gonna do an assembly build. I'm gonna solder together on video. And I'm also going to uh, show videos of how to set it up and how to use it. It's gonna be really interesting. I think it's gonna take my Morse code CW uh, learning to the next level. I need a coffee. How am I going to get it? How did that happen? Man, that was easy. Boy, this is just a nasty day. There's probably a 10 mile an hour wind going that way. And there's nobody here, so I'm not gonna, in danger of getting hit. That's pretty cool though, check that out. Check that out. Man, I gotta come here. At my level, probably 20 yards is right here. That's about what I could hit accurately I might be able to go to 30 I'm not I, I'm not good at all you know I just got a compound bow so I'd be pretty confident right here at 20 yards there's 40 yards and 60 and 70 yards 70 is like the, the biggest one okay I really feel like I'm forcing it today <laughs> I'm forcing it because the conditions are bad uh, especially the wind so I found this, I scouted this little area over here, and there is some shelter from the wind because it's coming from that direction. So let's see what we can do. And I'm gonna have to have a really low takeoff angle of my antenna into that tree or that tree, I don't know. That tree there is very short, I don't like it. I actually threw it over and the wind blew the cord and sat with it away. Let's try and get it this time. Okay, so if you can see my antenna right here, I haven't hooked it up yet. By the way, everything is real stiff because it's so cold out. That's how cold it is. It's not that cold really, it's just the wind. The wind is what makes it miserable, but at least there's no mosquitoes. All right, so I would throw it over that tree behind you 
I would sail it three or four times. I threw it. The beanbag would go over. The wind would catch the cord, that light cordage, blow it all the way over the tree. Two or three times. And then one time I threw it perfectly, it blew it onto the side. So every time you do that, you have to start all over. Anyway, here we are. Let's see if we can make a contact. Okay, we're doing good here. I've got everything kind of out of the way and kind of orderly. I'm gonna try to make a contact. Hit tune. Hopefully, if you look down, you can see. Oh man, the wind's even blowing my paper around. You can kind of you can see my radio and see what uh, frequency I'm on. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to push it like that so I can key myself. All right, 14068. It's one of my favorite frequencies. Somebody's calling CQ already. All right, this QSO just ended. If I hear CQ, I'm gonna answer. It was WB6IZG. Even my pen is not flowing well today with the cold. Ah, crud. Ten watts, fourteen oh five. W Y four J. Do it. says I'm weak. 
Okay, I'm kind of mad because I got into QSO with somebody. He's a real nice guy. He had a lot of patience, but my key on the left side started messing up. It started doing DAWs on both sides, so I couldn't send. I was like, DAW. I'd be like, da, da, da. And I was trying to do a dit, and it was DAWing every time. I hate this key. It's a piece of junk. Can you see it? That key there that comes with the Elecraft, it's expensive. It's a piece of junk. It was literally going, da, 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 da. I mean, in the middle of a QSO. What the hell? Um, so anyway, I felt bad because I was in the middle of a QSO, and the guy was probably like, what the heck? I'll probably email him later and tell him about this, but I'm very disappointed. I will consider this a contact. Um, because that key's not working, I'm gonna have to quit today. Um, look at the angle of that, that is so bad. But the sun's starting to come out. Let's go take a look at the water. I don't know how good this camera does walking. This uh, 360 Garmin Verb, I will tell you though, the battery life is horrendous. I already, I bought another battery and I had to just put another one in. I've never run out of battery before, but this is like a 30 minute battery basically. And I have everything turned off. I've got Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, everything turned off. So I bought another battery. Guess what? I bought a third battery because it also takes a long time to charge. Let's go take a look down here. There's people over there fishing. I can't believe they're fishing in this cold wind. But then again, I'm doing radio, which is probably dumber. <laughs> yeah, this is it. All right, guys, I'm going to say seven threes. Thanks for joining me. Sorry I didn't make more contacts, but seriously, I'm going to throw that key in the garbage. I'm going to have to get another key because that thing is a piece of junk. I liked it because it was connected and I could carry it with me, but...